Let's go over how to empty the cassette toilet or black tank. Now those are two terms that can be used interchangeably. To start with, select the key that says Thetford. Thetford is the name of the toilet system. We unlock the top button and there's a second button on the bottom. Push them both in and the door opens. Inside is the actual cassette. There's a small tab located here, which you need to push up to release and then the cassette slides out. Designed similarly to a roll around toilet, it has a small handle, which lifts up like this. So I'm here in front of my house at the sewer clean out. This is exactly the same kind of hole that you would find at a standard clean out at an RV park, a state park, things like that. So there's just a clean out cap on top, which I'll remove. Next, I open up the cassette. And before I start to pour, I rotate the nozzle towards the hole. And then I just tip in and empty the contents. Once empty, I fill with a little bit of water, maybe about a third full, and rinse it out. I put the cap back on, shake it. And empty again. Now I'll complete this process three times to make sure that the inside of the tank is clean. The final step of the process is to add some fluid, the idea of the fluid is that it keeps the tank fresh while you're using it, and it also helps to break down the toilet paper. Now, keep in mind, you should only ever be using RV toilet paper in a cassette toilet. We supply two rolls with the vans, and you can pick up extras at any Walmart or RV store. So, this is the fluid. We also supply a bottle in the van, AquaChem. It's kind of a blue fluid. And it doesn't take much, about one to two ounces, which I just pour right in the nozzle. That's enough. Last step, put the cap back and put it back in the vein.